guys, I am sure you are in the midst of getting all of your Christmas preparations done. I'm in the same boat as well. It is that time. <laughs> um, and so I am starting on my grocery shopping for the Christmas holiday. So what I did was I put an order into my grocery store's website and had them do the shopping for me and I just drove up and picked everything up this afternoon and let me tell you, we got in there about 11 o'clock in the morning and the parking lot was packed. I was so thankful I did not have to schlep both of my kids into the grocery store and do all of this shopping. Um, if you have that available in your area, I would so suggest it. <laughs> um, anyways, I'm going to flip you around and share with you everything that I picked up. We also went to the bulk food store. We went to the health food store. And then we also have to go to Costco tonight. So I'm going to put those hauls also into this video because it kind of all focuses around Christmas. Secondly, we will do one more grocery shop before Christmas. Um, my husband and I are going away this weekend, so some of the things that we picked up will just be for kind of the weekend and early next week. Um, it's my daughter's birthday, so some of this food that you'll see will be for her birthday. Um, and then we'll also do one more grocery shop before Christmas, and I'll again probably just place an order online so that I can fill in the missing pieces of more fresh things that we need and anything else that we could possibly be missing. But I'm going to flip you around, share with you everything. I'm going to start over here with the cold stuff because my camera battery keeps dying, um, and I want to make sure I can get this stuff put away. So I picked up two bags of french fries. So these are going to be for my daughter's birthday. We're having all the family over and we're going to do hot dogs and french fries. We got those. And these will be for likely either Christmas morning or um, Christmas Eve. Uh, these are these breakfast um, potatoes. Um, home fries. <laughs> um, so we got two packs of those. And then Cool Whip, this is for banana cream pie, two packages of dip for chips, some green beans, and corn. And then I got this little pack of chicken wings. I'll make chicken wings one night for dinner. And then I got this little ham. So we're going to do um, sliders, and I'm thinking that I may just use this ham for the sliders. Um, and then a pack of pepperettes. Okay, so we got two packs of hot dog buns. They unfortunately got squished, which I wasn't too happy about, but whatevs. Um, the one thing, the only thing that they didn't include in my order was the hot dogs themselves. So we like a particular brand. Um, they're a natural hot dog, and I didn't want a substitution because um, we're kind of picky about that. Um, and so we'll just have to go and buy those another day closer to her birthday. Um, two boxes of craft dinner. Now this is just something my kids have very occasionally. Like I said, my husband and I are going away this weekend. Um, so my in-laws are watching the kids and I think probably for an easy dinner they will have one of these. And then two packs of goldfish crackers. These are already got into because kiddos wanted some for lunch. Two boxes of spaghetti. And then three cans of soup. These are good for a quick lunch, um, either for my husband or just like on the weekend. So we got two um, chicken corn chowders and then one uh, vegetable beef. Two packs of unbleached flour. We've been doing a ton of Christmas baking and this is my flour container back here and it's almost out and we have more cookies to bake. Um, and these ones right here, we're gonna frost later this afternoon. So, um, another um, a pack of planters, a uh, pack, a jar of planters peanut butter. <laughs> so, this is a kilogram. So, just a little note to always be watching your prices. So, this planters peanut, peanut butter is one kilogram. Um, it cost $3.98, and the 500 um, gram container uh, was $3.99, so one penny more for half of this amount, so it made way more sense just to get this, so be aware of your prices. So we have these Nilla wafers, um, and this is for banana cream pie, and same with the Jello. o um, This is instant uh, vanilla Jello. that's for the banana cream pie, and um, two pink lemonade 
Oh, no, one. Oh, gosh, I'm missing a couple of these. Um, one pink lemonade water enhancers. I had ordered two more. I have to go check my receipt. Um, and then a Truvia Parmesan cheese. Uh, these, uh, likely for some baking or treats. And those we haven't had in a year. It's for birthday breakfast. So, to hide that. <laughs> um, some tortilla chips. And then lots of chips, um, two bags of regular ruffles, Doritos, and then um, the nacho Doritos, and then cool ranch Doritos. And these will be for snacking for the holidays. So this is some of the fresh stuff. I got a bunch of radishes, um, six ambrosia apples, some clementines, grapes were on sale this week, a cucumber, and two heads of romaine lettuce. That is supper thawing for tonight's dinner. Um, and then this is all of the non-food items. So I picked up a few bottles of shampoo and conditioner. Um, we got Herbal Essence Honey I'm Strong Conditioner, Herbal Essence Moroccan My Shine Shampoo, um, L'Oreal Total Repair Conditioner. I absolutely love, 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 love this conditioner and the shampoo. Um, and then Herbal Essence um, Daily Detox uh, Volumizing Shampoo. And so we don't have a dishwasher and I just don't want to be hefting to do lots of dishes, um, hand washing my dishes, you know, Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, Boxing Day. I just, I don't want to. <laughs> I want to enjoy the holiday. So I did pick up these plastic forks. Um, we will have lots of family that will come over and it will just be easier to have kind of some paper plates and forks and things of that nature. So got those. And then I got these um, disposable pie pans. Um, I'm going to do cinnamon rolls, and I may be making some for other people, so I want to have those on hand. And then um, I needed some face wash. Um, I've never used this Nivea Purifying Cleansing Gel before. It was on sale. All of the Nivea stuff was. It's for combination to oily skin, which um, I have oily skin, but in the winter it's kind of a lot uh, drier, so I don't know. Hopefully that will, will do nicely. Um, and then I also needed um, some day moisturizer. And this is a mattifying day cream. So I'm excited to try this. I'm hoping it will work well on my skin. And then my ride or die hairspray can't be without. Uh, Tresemme uh, Tray 2, level 4. And then this is a Christmas gift, stocking stuffer. And so is this for my husband. And then this one is just for me. So a couple spin brushes. And I will probably use that now because I'm not buying my own stocking stuff. My husband can. <laughs> um, and then some cotton balls. I like to use these to soak up my Scentsy Wax. So um, we got a couple other things. We got this um, Cranberry Sprite. So I don't drink soda anymore. Um, I drink Zevia. It's kind of like a natural pop. It's really carbonated. If you're looking to detox from pop, it's so good. I really love it. Um, but I can do Sprite every once in a while and this Cranberry Sprite is something that we always had growing up um, for holidays. So I picked up a few cans, um, well this case, <laughs> um, uh, for when everyone comes over and we kind of all enjoy this. So that should be a lovely treat. And then I also got a 12-pack of water as well. Um, I like to have water on hand for emergencies, and my family has been kind of going through one of the packs, unbeknownst to me. <laughs> so um, I went and replenished that as well. Okay, so I'm going to share with you what I got from the bulk store. So first I got the kiddos this vitamin D3. It was 40% off, which was really awesome. Because we live in northern Ontario, it is really difficult to get outside in the winter to get natural vitamin D. Um, even as a breastfeeding mom, we actually, for where we live, we had to double the dose of giving our children um, a vitamin D uh, supplement. Um, as a nursing mom, you have to do that. Anyways, um, and so we had to double that dose because of where we live. So I decided to pick these up for the kids. I like that they were sugar-free, which is... Kind of really great, so got that. 
And then I got a snowman cookie cutter. We actually made all of our sugar cookie cutouts at this point, but I did not have a snowman. So um, when I saw this hanging, I figured, you know what, I'm just going to get this and stick it in my box for next year. And then I got some Greek seasoning. I love to get my seasonings at the bulk store because I don't have to get like a big pack of them. I can get what I need and this will last for quite a while. I like to sprinkle this on um, chicken and into salad dressings. I got some nutritional yeast. This one is, I think this is allspice. I totally completely forgot to write down what it is, but I'm fairly certain this is allspice. And yes, and then this one is ground cloves. I picked up some smoked paprika. I love smoked paprika. This is so good on fried eggs and it's also really good on chicken. It is like, I think probably my favorite spice. And then I needed some garlic salt, dried minced onion. I picked up this pack of salted caramel coffee for myself. Um, I've been really wanting something different other than just regular coffee. Um, I'm the only one who really drinks it, I guess, because um, my husband's always at work. Um, and so I decided to pick myself up this little pack. This was another thing I picked up for the kids. So this is um, Omega-3, and this was also 40% off. This is a chocolate-flavored um, Omega-3. My favorite candy is peanut butter cups, and so I picked up a few peanut butter cups for the holidays. I don't know if... Um, I don't have enough here to do like peanut butter blossom cookies um, where you use like the peanut butter cup, but I might do that. Who knows? Got some animal crackers for the kiddos. And then we're going to decorate our um, sugar cookies today. So I got sprinkles. I got red and green. And then these were super cute. These are snowflakes. I'll try a snowflake. Not right now. In a little bit. We're going to make our cookies. And then some white sanding sugar, also for the cookies. And let's see what else. Um, let's see my bag of tricks here. Rice, rice. Nope. Um, I got some celery salt. And then they have lots of different shapes of pasta, which was so fun. And so I got mm. some zoo animals for the kids. I may make some like homemade macaroni and cheese, or even just some buttered noodles, and use these fun pasta shapes. We've got a bunch of birthdays coming up, so I thought it'd be fun to get some rainbow sprinkles. I also got some thyme. They also had a big vat of crushed candy canes. Now, I do have candy canes on hand that um, I can crunch up, but sometimes that just takes a while and you just need a little bit, so um, I got some of these. And it was just such like a fun-looking big container of crushed candy canes. So then next, I got some Epsom salts, and I got a bottle of sweet almond oil. So I'm going to make some whipped body butter and some different salves and hand cream type stuff, um, and so this will go into that. And then I got just a bunch of candy. I'm going to make some candy packs for some people that I know, um, and so we got some, just a bunch of different, different fun candies. and some cinnamon red hearts. Um, we always had these growing up to stick on our frosted sugar cookies, so we might put a few of these on the cookies. And then these can also go in some like hot apple cider and things like that. And that is everything that I got from the box store. Okay, so now that it's just you and I, I wanted to let you know that some of that candy was for my kids' stockings. They were kind of like milling about, but I got, um, gummy whales for my daughter. She's like so into whales right now. And I got gummy frogs for my son. And then I'm going to mix up some of the other candy and put in uh, my husband's stockings. So they'll get like little bags of candy. Um, and it'll, as a mom, it will be easier to kind of portion that out after Christmas so that they can, I can say, okay, you can have one piece of candy or you can have two pieces of candy. It's a little bit easier to divide that kind of thing up than it's supposed to like a chocolate bar. Um, so that's how we're going to roll with that. Okay, so last we went to the health food store and I got some things. Um, most are Christmas related, so I will go ahead and just share with you, but not all of it is food. 
So I got a pack of Dreamfields noodles. These noodles are excellent if you're in Trim Healthy Mama. It's sort of like a low carb uh, pasta. It tastes exactly like regular pasta. It's really, really good. Um, and so I picked up a box for myself. And then I got a bottle of this Nature's Aid lotion. So this is excellent if you have dry, chapped, or irritated skin. Um, this stuff is absolutely wonderful. It's an aloe vera gel. Uh, it's also got witch hazel, tea tree, vitamin E, and rosemary in it, and this stuff is wonderful. Um, when my son was little, he had a couple of diaper rashes, and he'd just gotten sick, and so, you know, just yuck. Anyways, his skin was just raw, and we put this stuff on, and within a day, it was cle cleared up and healed. It w it's just so awesome. So he has really sensitive skin. Um, already his cheeks are really chapped, so I'm going to start sticking this um, on his uh, chapped skin. I also got the kids some toothpaste. This is uh, Nuco um, Bubblegum Toothpaste for Kids. It has stevia, aerobic oxygen, and tea tree oil. It's gluten and fluoride free. So we got that. Um, it has no sodium lauryl sulfate either. So got that. And then... I'm going to attempt to make some bath bombs. Um, they had a bath bomb mold. They had like a really, really large one for 50 cents more, but I thought this would be kind of a much better size. I don't know if it's kind of showing up. Um, so it's a little bit smaller than the palm of my hand. The other one was about the size of the palm of my hand, really, really big. And those ones I feel like you would just have to break anyways to kind of use, so I got the smaller one. And then they only had one, or I would have gotten a couple more, because I think you have to, like, let the mixture set, but we'll see what we do. Okay, so also I picked up some shea butter. Like I mentioned, I'm going to make some of my own, um, like, whipped body butter and different homemade products, so I needed shea butter. And this is virgin organic uh, shea butter from Ghana, um, so good stuff. <laughs> I also picked up some activated charcoal. For the bath bombs, you'll need citric acid. And at the bulk barn, where the bulk food store, I could get uh, citric acid there. Came in a little bit bigger of a pack, but it was $20, and this one was only five. So, much better deal here, I'm glad I waited. I got three little, <laughs> three little bees of beeswax. These are so cute. These were $1.50 each. Um, I'm going to go ahead and grate them up for the different um, salves and different things that I'm going to make. Um, if you're interested in that video, I will try and film something. Just let me know down below and I can try and do that. Um, these were $1.50 each. They also had like a big brick of beeswax and it was $15. But I opted just to go with this because I'll probably be doing smaller batch items. And then lastly, I got some Now Brands Peppermint Oil. So that is everything for the um, natural food store. Um, we are going to head to Costco tonight and pick up a few more things. But that is it for this portion of the haul. Okay, friends, so it is a little after 10 o'clock at night. We just got back from Costco and visiting my in-laws. So I'm going to flip you around and share with you what we picked up tonight at Costco. So tonight we didn't get a ton of food. We got a few things as Christmas gifts and some stocking up items that we'll need over the holidays. So little tip for you. Um, make sure that you have the things on hand that you normally use on a regular basis. Things like garbage bags, dish soap, dishwashing detergent, laundry soap. All that kind of stuff because the last thing that you want to do is have to go out right before the holidays or right after the holidays to get those things that you need so if your kiddos are in diapers or you need formula or wipes any of that stuff make sure that you get it before the holidays okay so we got some milk we got two creams for coffee eggnog and four butters I already have two in the freezer and then one in the fridge but again we're doing lots of baking so and I like to have lots of butter on hand. Uh, yogurt, avocado oil, some hamburger buns. These are for my husband for Christmas. He actually got a pair of Adidas sneakers they were sitting right here but he just came and took those uh, to wear. <laughs> 
Um, we got this Honest Company um, shampoo and body wash. I love this stuff. I actually use this as a body wash as opposed to anything else. Um, and I use this on my kids as well. So the three of us use this. Um, like I said, we needed um, garbage bags. So 320 And this pack was um, $15. So this is a significant savings over what we normally get at the grocery store. Then I got... Um, this three pack of Batiste. So I like to use some dry sh shampoo a couple times a week. Um, and one of these bottles is sometimes around $10 that I can get here in Canada, kind of at the drugstore. Um, and so this whole pack was actually $12.99. So really good savings there. And then this is right here is going to be a gift for my daughter for Christmas. Um, this is the entire Beverly Cleary collection of books, and I don't know how many there are in here. Let's see, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 16 books. 16 books, and this was $25. So I had looked at this set on Amazon, and I think it was between $35 and $40. So really, really good, good deal here, and I know that she's going to love like the Ramona books and Henry Higgins and all of that. So... I'm really excited about this set. And then I got um, some makeup removing wipes. I was almost out of these. And again, make sure that you are checking those things that you use on a really regular basis so that you are not out when Christmas time comes. We got this big container of sugar and it broke. <laughs> so I'm going to have to figure out what to do with this. I had just filled up my sugar container with a smaller pack and I had just planned to put this in the pantry. However, I got to deal with that. So. Um, we also got a two-pack of pillows. My son needed a new pillow, um, and probably my daughter as well, so we're going to give those to them. And we got this broom set. So this was a really good deal. This is $8. You got two brooms, a dustpan, and then there's also a little hand broom attached with this. So this will be something for out in the garage. And lastly, we got a big bag of dog food. So... That is our haul. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And like I said, I will have my um, Christmas menu and any other um, Christmas stocking up that we do before the holidays posted in the next few days. Hope you guys have a really good day and happy shopping. Bye.